Oh yeah, so listen, I've just I've just packed the car, uh, and uh, the arrangement is basically I have a front door that I can open from the inside, but uh, I, I don't like to have a, it unlockable from the outside because security, optimal privacy and all of that. So I have to walk out the back door, bring the car around. The, well, I pick a car first, then I bring the SUV today around, bring the SUV around, park it out the front next to what I... It's the front sliding glass door, but I call it the loading dock. It's my place, my choice, my life. Moi aussi. Mm -mm. I think I got something in my teeth. So I bring the car around, but then I realize I didn't open the door and I can't open it from the outside with it's unlockable from the outside. So I go around, have to walk around the back again, and then I come through and I un unlock the door, open the sliding door. Then I walk all the way around the outside and forgetting, not realizing I could just walk through the door that's now open because the car is right there. I don't know why. I think I just sort of spaced that, like the kids say. But, but then I realized motor memory just force a habit, physical uh, 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 conditioning, Pavlov's diggity dog. Uh, uh, when I go in the back door, I unlock the back door, I come in and I just put my key in the door. Uh, my key lives in the door on the inside. I probably shouldn't tell people that. Ow, I got an itchy eye. Ah, ooh, that feels good. So anyway, oh, it's just, it's, it seems easy to pack the car, but it really is really complicated. That's all I'm trying to say. All right, got to hit the road. All right, fun lovers, Ronald Burns here. I'm just backstage in my uh, plush, decadent, high-end, exotic green room here at this DJ gig I'm doing for friend's 50th. She's so old. Uh, I'm all set. This is what it looks like. This is what the set looks like. That's the backstage. That's from my perspective. This is what I'll be seeing all night. with people on that dance floor of course but it's a beautiful intimate space not quite as intimate as the bedroom here I say bedroom it's really more of a mid-renovation bathroom all everything a man needs a place to lie down between sets somewhere to relieve oneself by which I mean place a little water on my face um, yeah It, seriously, it is such a cool space. It's real uh, intimate and moody. It's a basement club, basically. It's a basement club. Upstairs is where the house is and the family lives. And downstairs is right here where the good times happen. It's where the fun begins and, uh, and the fun sometimes finishes. But quite often it'll go somewhere else to die later. But not here. It lives forever right here with Ivana Burns on the decks for the next seven, seven or eight hours probably. That's what I'm anticipating from about 7.30 p.m. Chilled out, ease into the evening, and by nine it'll be uh, pumping. Uh, disco. And big shout out to uh, Guy Raguin in uh, New Caledonia who's playing his DJ gig at the very exact same time. Hello! <laughs> Peace, big love to you, brother. Bonsoir, monsieur. 80s, 90s, I'll be doing the same right here, but uh, all over the map as well. So uh, you'll see some footage of what transpired probably coming up in a second or two. But uh, for now, from pre-show, Vinyl Burns, Basement Bar, Disco Party. Uh, see you real soon. All right, ciao, ciao.
one hand transition. That's right. One hand on the camera, one hand on the deck, mother lover.